Hey, it's Nick here. I hope you're having a great day. I wanted to make a short recording <clears throat> to share with you something I'm doing that I've never done before, actually. I'm looking for a few people that would like to work with me personally. And um, <clears throat> mo most of you know me, right? Uh, you've been in this group for a long time. Some of us have go back 10, 11 years. We've done some real estate deals together and we've done a lot of things together. Um, <clears throat> and like I said, I've never done what I'm going to tell you about now for a few different reasons. I'll explain why, but I feel it's the perfect time. And just looking for a few people that want to hitch their hitch their wagon to me and, and, and come along for the ride. Um, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Nick Sifoni. I think you probably know that much. And um, <clears throat> I've spent 35 years in sales and marketing or so. And I'll give you the Cliff Notes version because I know you really don't care. But I opened, uh, in 1984, I owned a door-to-door -door sales company. And um, we peddled, basically. We went business to business with a box under our arm. And we sold perfume and jewelry and pots and pans and luggage and um, car radios and car speakers and all kinds of stuff. And uh, I literally hired 40 people a day for nine, about nine years and trained and motivated the people. And then uh, I got into the wine business and we sold wine by telephone and we sold it by the case. We called people um, and said, hey, I, uh, what was our first line? Oh, my gosh, I don't even remember. There was like 50 of us. I, I, ran, the, I, I ran the whole operation. But, um, oh, your name was passed on to us as someone who likes a good glass of wine from time to time. So I have door-to-door -door sales experience. I have a lot of wine experience. Or I don't even drink wine. But phone phone sales experience. Um, and then, as you know, I got into real estate. And I had a group of people that I trained and I worked with. And we made great money in the real estate business. And the last seven or eight years, I've been doing internet marketing, affiliate marketing. I own a digital marketing agency. So uh, small companies call me, small and medium businesses. We do their search engine optimization, their social media marketing. We build their websites, sales funnels, things like that. And that kind of runs kind of runs its by itself right now. Um, so what am I doing? I'm going to put these on because I have some notes hidden up here, hidden from you, not from me, but I can't see them without the glasses. So um, what, what I'm doing now, I'm getting into a, ne a network marketing company. And um, I've always believed in network marketing or multi-level marketing, whatever you want to call it. And gosh, I have been... I, I bet you I've had people try to recruit me. Here. I, maybe I should get contacts or bifocals or something. But um, I bet you I've had people try to recruit me literally 50 times. Back when I was doing the, the, the outside sales, since I interviewed so many people after I'd hire them, I, I had so many people come up to me and say, oh, my gosh, Nick, you would be so perfect at this. And I, and I always turned them down. I always said, no, it's not for me. And it's not because I, I thought they were scammy. And obviously, there are some that used to be scammy. Um, there might still be now. I don't know. Um, but the reason I did it was I kind of felt I would do OK at it. But in my heart of hearts, I knew I had to recruit and bring in other people. And I just didn't believe that those other people could succeed at it because it was so tough. Um, really tough business to succeed in. I think the the way it's set up is wonderful. Um, you know, you, 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 you learn to market the products yourself. Then you teach other people how to market the products. Then you build a team. And I, I think it's one of the most incredible money-making opportunities. And um, I think, and I'm kind of, I've read this. I, I don't know. I could Google it or you can Google it because I don't really care. But I, but I think the two businesses that have made the most millionaires in like the last three decades um, is network marketing and real estate, to be honest with you. So, um, so I've always believed in it, but I never, I never did it. And, um, and the reasons, I mean, a lot of the reasons are kind of obvious, at least in the old days, the products used to be way overpriced, um, or most of them, and, and they had to be right. If you were paying, you know, a commission to the person that sold it and then a little bit of a little bit to the person that recruited them, the person that recruited them. The price, the products just had to be overpriced to work. And a lot of the products, let's face it, sucked, right? But um, a lot of them are great products, like about 1990 or so, maybe you've heard of Herbalife. Um, I lost about 50 pounds 
with Herbalife using their, their program. So I've used some network marketing products, but I've never been willing to get involved and, and to jump in. Um, for the most part, though, a lot of the products were too expensive, uh, like I said, because, because of the way it worked. And, and, you know, you usually were selling to your friends and neighbors so you can get away with it. Um, nowadays, though, it, it's, it's just too tough. I mean, you're selling something... And I don't know about, I'm not, in, I'm in the industry now. I've just got in the industry. Um, but I know that in a lot of cases, if something's selling for 35 bucks, you might be able to sell some. There goes my dog. You might be able to sell some, but um, you could probably go on amazon.com and find the same thing or something really similar in quality and probably just really, maybe even the same thing for 1995. Um, so that's one of the reasons I never was willing to get into network marketing. Um, and I met so many people over the years who literally had a garage full of boxes and stuff because of the monthly quotas and they couldn't sell it, but they wanted to make their overrides. So they buy it and stack it in their garage and, and, and quotas and things like that. So, and, and I didn't, maybe I just wasn't willing to work so hard, but one of the other reasons I never got involved was because of the way that it was always sold. Um, they would teach people to do garage, macro, uh, hotel sales. And a buddy of mine literally made millions of dollars back in, in the mid nineties in new skin. Um, and I screwed around with it, but I never took it seriously. So, but uh, you know, he, he used to have hotel parties where he'd spend like the first three weeks of every month trying to recruit people to show up at a hotel party. Um, where they talk about the opportunity and then show the products and some people would buy the products some people would join um and the thing that really turned me off and it was a little embarrassing to me was that most of them the first thing they want you to do is create a list of 100 people that you know and obviously it's your friends and family um and those are the first people that you're supposed to pitch the product to and um one guy i know that i interviewed years ago he told me that I joined and a couple of days later, I went to my sponsor's house and I brought my phone book and then he went through my phone book with me and called everybody I knew and oh my gosh, that would, I, I just, so those are the reasons I've never been involved. And maybe you've been through some of these, maybe you've made great money, maybe you've failed, I don't know. Um, but things have changed. Uh, I just joined an, a network marketing opportunity called iBoomerang. Um, and the guy at the head of it, uh, Holton Bugs, he um, he holds the record for making the most money in any one in a downline from any one single position. Um, I believe he holds the record, and it's supposedly it's nine figures. And I, I don't know, I don't know, even know if my calculator will go nine figures, but um, he made a million dollars a month. And he didn't own the company; he was just in the company, so he knows the business. Well, he just started this company called iBoomerang that I got involved with. And the reasons I got involved with it, it's kind of like the Uber of travel. And um, I mean, you know, Uber, the ride company. You've probably used Uber. I know if you haven't, you know someone that has. They don't own a single car, right? So Uber is not a car company. It's not a travel company. What is it? It's a technology company, right? You pick up your phone. So the product and is, is a few travel. buttons. And, and we say that we send it, someone we, to your we door. We it comes back to place. place. So time. we give people um, access to a free so website. So Uber's a technology a travel website. And, and they can go to the website. They, they, they can book hotel rooms to be at the $10 billion uh, rentals, year mark. Airfare. You can get flights through it, but no one's paid on flights because there's such a small margin on flights. But um, so hotels, rental cars, cruises, we can rent houses for a week, um, but we give the product away. And that's the coolest thing about it. We're not asking for people for money. We give it away. When people use it to book travel, then we earn a commission on whatever amount of travel that they take. So um, is where in the past you'd be embarrassed to tell your family and friends about it. Now you'll lose friends if you don't tell them about it. And, and the deals are incredible. Um, I just booked four nights in Vegas. I'm going to Vegas um, over Labor Day. And I booked four nights in Vegas. First, I went to Travelocity and booked it. I didn't book it, but I pretended to book it. I went all the way up to clicking the buy button. And it was 500, I think it was $527 for the four, four nights at the hotel I wanted to stay at. 
then I went to the I boomerang, I boomerang, I boomerang. It's called I go site. <laughs> Why couldn't they call it something simple, right? And um, 397 bucks for the same hotel in the same hotel for the same hotel, for the same room in the same hotel and the same things. So that's one of the reasons I got involved with this. The, the product is incredible. And every now and then you'll find prices that are almost similar because of the dates and availabilities and stuff. But for the most part, people you give these to will be thanking you because you're literally gonna save them money. So what a great concept. When they save money, you make money. It's a win-win for everyone involved and you don't have to keep it in your garage either. So. Um, and of course, if you want, and, and the nicest thing, you could make a living on this just by giving these boomerangs away, just by booking travel and never bringing anyone in. But you'd kind of be silly not to, right? It just makes sense to recruit people because it's such a great, it's such a great concept. Um, you'll always be paid on your travel as long as you're in the company. You don't have to have any certain quotas. You never have to buy it. You never have to use it yourself if you don't want to. Um, so anyway, the reason you would recruit is you would recruit for leverage, not because you have to, but if you recruit somebody, and I don't know how to do the zeros and dots yet, but um, if you recruit somebody, you get paid a percentage of the boomerangs they give away and so on and so on. So the leverage can really, really be incredible. It's, it's more like affiliate marketing, you know, when you just refer somebody and you get paid for it. And so that's the main bulk of how you make your money. But you can make a lot of money just promoting the pro the program as well, right? Um, and bringing other people in. And I, to be honest, I'm not even sure exactly how all that works. I think there's three different ways you make money, and I don't really care. I mean, I'll learn it, but um, all I'm I know how the money works. I know how I get paid my commission when I give somebody a, a, a link and they book a hotel. I know how that works, and I kind of know how the rest work. I'll learn that stuff later. I'm just sold on the concept. Uh, I'm sold on the on the way the industry works. Um, I told my wife, this will be the first and last network marketing company that I'll ever join because I really see the potential. And I think um, with everything I've done, my sales experience, my experience in hiring and training other people to sell, and now my internet marketing experience, if you let me help you, I really think I'll be the perfect mentor. And I really think that our team is gonna go somewhere. Um, the company started about five weeks ago, six weeks ago. The grand opening is in August or September. Um, I'm number 21 in the company. I'm on level number 21, right? There's gonna be thousands and thousands, you know, there's people that are gonna join in two years that are gonna be on level. 11,428, I'm level 21. So if you get involved, you're getting involved at the right time. Um, what else? I had some other notes here, but eh, I think I've told you the gist of it. Um, if you know people, I don't have to do this, but I mean, if you do know people that travel, or if you're just traveling, you're not interested in the opportunity at all, let me know, right? I'll hook you up. <laughs> um, but, I just think it's the it's perfect timing. At least I know it's perfect timing for me, and I'm making this to give you an opportunity to decide if it's perfect timing for you as well. And if you wanna hook your hitch to my wagon, or hook your wagon to my horse, or or, or something like that. So um, we're gonna do a lot of things. I'm gonna create a sales funnel that I can just hand over to the people that are in our program and teach you how to send people to it. You never have to recruit family and friends because of the internet these days. Um, I'm just looking for a few people to join with me at the top and, and, and get involved. So um, look down below. I don't even know where I put in this video yet, but look down below. I'm sure there's some information down there. Uh, and I really, I, I really, truly hope that you decide to get involved. That's it for now. I boomerang. Maybe you'll boomerang too. Thanks for watching. Take care.